You ready for some Hikaru Nakamura trivia? Sure. All right. What's your favorite Hikaru Nakamura video? I don't know if I have any specific favorite, but anytime like he starts losing and he's tilting, that's, <laughs> that's the most enjoyable for me. Okay. Oh, no! No! All right. What month was Hikaru Nakamura born in? December. What's his birthday? So he cars at his birthday during the London Chess Classic a few times. I think Anand is probably born on the 13th December. I'm gonna guess 9th. Wow, got it. Ding, ding, ding. What country was Hikaru Nakamura born in? I think Hikaru was born in Japan. What city of Japan? Um, Osaka. Okay, we're killing it. How many siblings does Hikaru have? Uh, I know that Hikaru has a brother who plays chess. Uh, I'm going to guess that he has one more sibling. No, oh, no, no, he only has one. Only one. And what's his brother's name? Asuka. There you go. So there I am. There I am, you guys. That's my brother, of course. What happened first? You winning the Norwegian Chess Championship or Hikaru winning the US Chess Championship? Well, Hikaru is three years older than I am. And I, I know he won the US Championship fairly young. And I did lose the playoff twice, so I'm going to guess that he won it first. That's correct. What year did he win it? Say probably 2003 or 2004. 2003? 2004. He had it, though. In Chess.com's database of games, what is Hikaru Nakamura's favorite first move as white? E4, D4, Knight F3, or B3? I think he's, that's, yeah, it's very hard. Okay, it's it's not D4, that's for sure. Um, I think it has to be either E4, because that's his main, that it really is his main move. But he he loves the Knight of Three setups and, and Blitz and probably plays them in Bullets. I would guess Knight of Three is his main first move. It actually is E4. Yeah, so and, it was the obvious. It, well, actually, I read it quickly because I was reading it. His second best scoring move is actually d3, not b3. So I was wrong about that, which kind of relates to knight f3. So his oh, be was it the best scoring or? Yes, his. I guess the question is, what was his best scoring move? E4. Oh, I thought it was the one he played the most. Yeah, ah, good blooper by me. Good blooper. Okay, so I'll say it again. Of all the moves that he's played more than a hundred times, what is his best scoring first move? And the answer is e4. Oh, yeah, but it makes sense that the best scoring move is e4 because he often plays like e4, uh, knight c3 setups against weaker players. Yeah, yeah. he beat all the time. So. Okay, there you go. So that makes sense. Figuring out the math on that. Before chess.com, Hikaru was the highest rated player on the Internet Chess Club with two usernames, two handles. Do you know what those two usernames were? It has to be Smallville and Capilano Rich. Nailed it. Bonus if you can name his username on play chess. I'm not sure that I've played Hikaru on play chess. No, I'm not gonna remember that. Star Wars. Star Wars, yeah, 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 I, yeah that's true. I, I definitely played Star Wars. Hikaru has authored one chess book. Do you know the title? Uh, wait a sec. I actually have, I have the book that he's authored. It's about bullet chess. Um, I think it's called like One Minute Checkmate or something. Yeah. Wow. Wow. With uh, like Bruce Harper. Is that yeah, right? you're, you're nailing it. Okay. What is Hikaru Nakamura's peak FIDE rating? Oh, let me see. I think Hikaru peaked at, well, he was number two in the world where a lot of people were pretty high rated. So I think it's got to be well over 2800s. 20, 2017? Oh man, you are good. You were close, 2016. 2016. Point something, so that was pretty good. All right, which of these events has Hikaru Nakamura won five of? The Speed Chess Championship, the Gibraltar Chess Festival, and the US Chess Championship? Uh, I think that's the trick question. I think he's won all of them at least five times. Only two. Did win Gibraltar five times. Only four? Yeah. Oh, it was a trick question. Yeah. Doing our best here. 
Who did Hikaru beat to win his first U.S. championship? Like in the last round? Uh, yeah, 2004. Uh, some reason the name that pops up is Kaidanov, so I'm going to go with that. Ildar Ibrahimov. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Close enough. No one would have known that one, I think. All right. Which TV show has Hikaru Nakamura made a cameo appearance on? Uh, I think Hikaru made um, a cameo on uh, Billions. That's right. Because they it. could not get me. They did. Uh, Which is a true story, by the way. What was it? They got him because they couldn't get me. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. I love that. All right. Last question. When commentating on the XQC Moist Critical match, how many moves was that game over in? Who was Hikaru's co commentator? And what was Hikaru Nakamura's final? thing he said right before the checkmate. How many moves? Uh, I mean, that's the scotch game, right? Uh, like there was probably made on F2. How does it go? C3, Vision C5. Yeah, probably five moves then. I think that was, was that four moves? One, two, Three, four, five, six. It was six moves. Six moves, four yeah. Moves. Who was his co-commentator? Uh, who was come? Was that the first part champ? First part champs. Too soon, Hikaru. That was the line. Uh, was it you? No, Botez, oh, Alexandra. Okay. okay. Yeah. Last question. Do you remember the last thing Hikaru said? Uh, no. Random line. He didn't like the variational approach. So I'm not sure that I like the like the variational approach here. No, please don't. And it's too soon. It's too soon, Hikaru. We didn't even reach a climax. Uh, okay. We tried to stump you in the end, but we really didn't do a very good job. I wonder if Hikaru is going to do as well with Magnus Carlsen trivia. That was impressive. Yeah, I feel like I did okay. Yeah. Almost a bit creepy. Almost a bit creepy. <laughs>